America is the cheeseburger. From burgers to pizza to tacos, America is the land of fast food. However, some food and drinks stand out more than others. Here are 10 fast food menu items that defined America. Everybody loves it. KFC Original Recipe Fried Chicken. I brought fried chicken! Popeyes and Chick-fil-A may be giving KFC a run for its money, but there's no doubt that KFC's original fried chicken is an American classic. Who can resist that secret blend of 11 herbs and spices? There's nothing quite like it. Let's face it, the KFC fried chicken secret recipe is more valuable than gold. The recipe is so precious that KFC keeps it in a vault. Spies from rival chicken joints would need James Bond-level skills to get their hands on it. I got skills. I got skills. In the 1960s, KFC's popularity spread across the globe. Today, the Colonel's finger-licking good chicken is famous from London to Tokyo. Despite its global presence, it's still most popular in the United States. Without Kentucky Fried Chicken, there would be no Popeyes, Bojangles, or Zaxby's. There are plenty of imitators, but only KFC is the true original. Starbucks Pumpkin Spice Latte Everything is pumpkin spice. Whether you love it or hate it, there's no denying that the pumpkin spice latte is an iconic Starbucks drink. It's quite possibly the most iconic. You know Thanksgiving is right around the corner when the pumpkin spice latte makes its triumphant return. Starbucks first released this fall favorite way back in 2003. Today, the pumpkin spice latte is Starbucks' most popular seasonal drink, with more than 200 million cups sold to date. That's a whole lot of pumpkin spice mix and more than 80 million dollars in revenue for Starbucks every year. Oh, that's a lot. Maybe we should all be buying Starbucks stock. So what makes this autumn classic so popular? Perhaps it's the combination of cinnamon, nutmeg, and clove. Maybe it's the famous pumpkin pie flavored syrup. Or it might be all that delicious whipped cream. The pumpkin spice latte has even ushered in a new trend of pumpkin themed products like air fresheners, candles, and even cough drops. If Starbucks discontinued the pumpkin spice latte, there would quite possibly be a riot. Burger King Whopper I just had a Whopper. Burger King has been serving up Whoppers since 1957. Yes, even before the McDonald's Big Mac made its debut. The burger was an instant hit, and now Burger King sells 2.1 million Whoppers annually. That's enough Whoppers to make the competition mighty nervous. The Whopper's signature flame-grilled beef patty really sets it apart. Then there's the bun. A Whopper just wouldn't be the same without the famous sesame seed bun. The sesame seed bun was introduced in the 1970s when Pong was all the rage, and it was briefly replaced by a Kaiser roll in the 1980s. Even advertisements from Mr. T weren't enough to convince foodies. We don't care. Burger King fans wanted the sesame seed bun back. One of the best things about the Whopper is that you can have it your way. Customization is king at BK. If pickles aren't your thing, no worries. The king isn't going to make you eat them. The Whopper has proven to be so popular that Burger King has created numerous variations over the years, including the Impossible Whopper and the Whopper Jr. The Whopper Whopper Jr. was actually invented by mistake at a Burger King in Puerto Rico when regular-sized buns weren't available. It was such a success that Burger King launched it worldwide. Wendy's Frosty Frosty chocolate milkshakes Who needs ketchup when you can dip your fries in a Wendy's Frosty? Forget the Baconator or the baked potato, it's the Frosty that keeps fast food fans coming back to Wendy's. The delectable dessert only comes in chocolate or vanilla, but the great taste more than makes up for the lack of variety. It's not quite a milkshake and not quite ice cream. It's something in between, but that's what makes the Frosty so unique. Wendy's founder Dave Thomas introduced the Frosty way back in 1969 when Neil Armstrong was making one giant leap for mankind. Today, the Frosty is a fast food staple and an American icon. I'm the big dog now. Wendy's sells more than 300 million of the sweet treats each year. 
That's enough sugar to keep Willy Wonka in business for decades. Did you know that the original Wendy's Frosty was a mixture of chocolate and vanilla? Dave Thomas thought a pure chocolate Frosty would overpower the flavor of his hamburgers. Turns out he was right, because the modern-day chocolate Frosty still has a lighter chocolate flavor. Can you imagine a pure fudge Frosty? It sounds good in theory, but it probably wouldn't be suitable to dip your Frosty. In. Krispy Kreme Donuts I lost 47 pounds on the Krispy Kreme diet. There's no donut more iconic in America than the Krispy Kreme Donut. Krispy Kreme Donuts have truly defined America. Krispy Kreme's original glazed donut may be simple, but that's what makes it so great. Krispy Kreme does sell a wide variety of donuts, but the original glazed donut is what keeps customers coming back. Krispy Kreme doesn't need fancy toppings or fillings like the competition. Can you imagine what Duncan would do if there was a sprinkle shortage? They'd be panicking big time, while Krispy Kreme would carry on like usual. I'm okay. If you're content with hot, fresh, and perfectly glazed donuts, then Krispy Kreme is the donut shop for you. They go great with coffee or a tall glass of milk. Here's a tip. Look out for that Krispy Kreme Hot Now neon sign. When it's lit up, you know that a baker is pulling a fresh tray of addictive Krispy Kreme donuts out of the oven. You might be surprised to learn that Krispy Kreme donuts are even older than Superman. Vernon Rudolph began selling them to grocery stores in North Carolina way back in 1937. They were an instant hit, and the recipe hasn't changed in 85 years. Subway Footlong Who were you, Subway? before you were Subway. Subway's $5 footlong deal will go down in history as one of the best fast food deals of all time. Subway's footlong subs may not be $5 anymore, but they're still iconic. Despite the rise of more healthy fast food choices like Chipotle and Panera Bread, Subway remains incredibly popular in America. There are still nearly 24,000 Subway locations in the U.S. That's more than McDonald's and Burger King combined. I'm better than you! Subway is famous for its cookies and soups, but it's the footlong sub that reigns supreme. Some folks like the footlong steak and cheese, while others prefer the oven-roasted chicken footlong sub. What's your favorite? Another great thing about the Subway footlong is that you can have your choice of fresh veggies. If you can stand the heat, you can pile on the banana peppers. Some folks get extra tomatoes, while others pack on the pickles. Just don't be like Tom Green and go overboard with the fresh veggies. The sandwich artist has to be able to close the sub. Taco Bell Soft Tacos Hey, I got your Taco Bell breakfast? Taco Bell might not be authentic Mexican food, but the Bell's famous soft tacos certainly are iconic in the fast food world. College frat boys can easily down 10 of them after a night of partying. Some folks prefer the cheesy gordita crunch or a Doritos Locos taco, but the Taco Bell Soft Taco is an American classic. There's something special about that soft flour tortilla and seasoned ground beef. The crisp shredded lettuce and real cheddar cheese are the perfect toppings, and you know Taco Bell is always willing to give you as many hot sauce packets as you want. Like unlimited? If you're a vegetarian, you can opt for a bean-based soft taco. You can even customize your soft taco and add onions and sour cream. Taco Bell has been serving up soft tacos since 1987, when Arnold faced off against the Predator. And there's no doubt they'll be on the menu for many years to come. As iconic as the soft taco is, it's probably not the most popular item on the Taco Bell menu. That honor goes to the Crunch Wrap Supreme. In second place, is the quesarito. The soft taco may take the bronze medal, but plenty of people think they're worthy of the gold. Dolly Parton says the soft shell taco is the best thing on the Taco Bell menu. She gets her soft shell tacos with mild hot sauce and sour cream. Domino's Pepperoni Pizza How about a pepperoni? 
Domino's pepperoni pizza is arguably the most popular fast food pizza in America. It's Domino's best-selling pizza and a staple at birthday parties, late-night hangouts, and movie marathons. Who can resist those crisp slices of pepperoni and all that gooey cheese? The Noid certainly can't. Domino's hand-tossed crust might just be the best pizza crust there is. Pizza Hut and Papa John's wish they had a crust like Domino's. A large Domino's pepperoni pizza is even better with a side of wings and an order of breadsticks. Add a big bottle of Coke and you're in heaven. I'm in heaven. The pepperoni pizza has been on Domino's menu since the restaurant was founded back in 1960 when the Flintstones first appeared on TV. Domino's pepperoni pizza was an instant hit and today it's more popular than ever. Waiting for a steaming hot Domino's pepperoni pizza to arrive on your doorstep is quite a challenge. The anticipation is enough to drive a person insane. There's just one problem when it comes to Domino's pepperoni pizza. It's incredible unhealthy. Each slice has about 290 calories, and you know you can't stop at just one piece. But as long as you only eat Domino's once in a while, you'll be fine. The Big Mac. I mean, that was the best burger I've ever had. The Big Mac is quintessential American comfort food, and it's easily the most famous McDonald's burger. The Quarter Pounder and McDouble wish they were as popular as the Big Mac. McDonald's sells about 550 million Big Macs every year. It's the best-selling McDonald's burger by far. Only the French fries are more profitable for McDonald's. Mickey D's has had a lot of burger failures over the years. The Arch Deluxe and the McDLT came and went, but the Big Mac will be around until the end of time. So what makes the Big Mac so special? Perhaps it's the extra middle bun or the shredded lettuce. Maybe it's that iconic special sauce. It's the best sauce I've ever tasted. Many have tried to replicate the special sauce at home, but no one seems to be able to get it quite right, even though the recipe is no longer a secret. Only McDonald's can make a perfect Big Mac sauce. Some folks like to get their Big Mac with extra pickles, while others splurge on a double Big Mac with a couple of extra patties and more cheese. The only thing better than a classic Big Mac is a Big Mac with bacon. The Big Mac is even popular in India, where beef is sacred. However, in India, it's known as the Maharaja Mac and made with chicken instead of beef. Dairy Queen Blizzards Dairy Queen closes in 10 minutes. It seems like there are more Blizzard flavors than there are Pokemon. Some folks love the Oreo Blizzard, while others can't get enough of the Reese's Peanut Butter Cup Blizzards. These thick and creamy sweet treats are so popular that there are new flavors being released all the time. There's even a special Blizzard each month to keep customers coming back to Dairy Queen. Cookie dough, strawberry cheesecake, lemon meringue, s'mores, M&Ms, and even sea salt toffee. The possibilities are endless. Who knows what blizzard flavor Dairy Queen will come up with next? There are even seasonal blizzards like the festive candy cane chill blizzard and the Thanksgiving-themed pumpkin pie blizzard. There's no doubt that the blizzard is an American fast food classic. That's for sure. Dairy Queen has been serving up sweet treats since 1940, when Popeye cartoons were still played in movie theaters. However, the Blizzard is a relatively new creation. It wasn't on the menu until 1985, when Michael J. Fox went back to the future. The Blizzard was an instant hit, and Dairy Queen sold more than 175 million of them in the first year alone. Here's a tip. Make sure your server performs the famous upside-down Blizzard test when you order one of these tasty confections. If they forgot, you might just be entitled to a free blizzard. Order up more great videos. Just tap or click and hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to join our notification squad.